This is a patient who had some uh, biochemical abnormality that prompted some CT imaging. They saw a mass in the abdomen and uh, subsequently got an MRI. And so I'm just going to show you a few sequences from the MRI. And this is the T2-weighted sequence. And the abnormality is really um, in the retroperitoneum in this instance. And we can see it right over there. This is uh, the aorta. This is the IVC, which sort of the distal aspect of the aorta. We can see this uh, relatively T2 hyperintense mass that's sort of sandwiched between the aorta and IVC and um, has sort of lobulated borders. And that's sort of the isolated finding that we're seeing in this instance. It's unclear if it's one mass or a couple of masses adjacent to each other. Um, let's look at it on the post contrast sequences. This is the arterial phase. We can see there's avid enhancement associated with this mass. Just to give you an idea of where we are here, this is uh, the IMA that's sort of coming off right over there. And so it's really at the level of the IMA, just above the level of the uh, aortic bifurcation. We'll look at it on the next phase. We can see that uh, it remains um, enhancing, doesn't wash out, or uh, has no areas of rolling necrosis within it. And so that's the finding uh, in this patient. The patient had other symptoms of refractory hypertension, had elevated catecholamine levels. So they were looking for a paraganglioma. They were looking for potential pheochromocytoma. They saw this mass in the retroperitoneum. This is a great look for a paraganglioma arising from the organ of sucker candle. So it's a collection of these cells that are um, right at the aortic bifurcation, typically in the area of the IMA, inferior mesenteric artery. Um, and when you see a hypervascular mass, it may have that classic T2 uh, you know, light bulb bright signal as well. And the context is sort of the biochemical abnormality. We really need to think about a uh, paraganglioma. And in this instance, the organ of sucker candle a, a very common location to see this uh, outside of the uh, adrenal glands.